Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. So today I have a long awaited haul that I mentioned to you guys that I was gonna do. And it actually just consists of some thrifted things that I bought for both myself and the girls and the baby. And I probably will just start it in the order I don't know, in birth order from youngest to oldest, meaning I'll start with the baby, then proceed with the kids stuff, and then I'll show um, the very few things I picked up for myself. So, beginning with the baby stuff, because I know you guys are always interested. So clearly summer is around the corner, and honestly, baby girl, Zoe, has a lot of clothes, but she didn't have enough stuff now that the, wind, the weather's warming up, even though I felt like I had a lot of stuff. Um, some particular items that she needed were like white things. She's in the background. So if you hear baby, don't, you know, don't judge me. Sometimes this is the best way to be able to get stuff done. But one particular thing I realized that she didn't have was just like some plain white tees, some plain white tops to go with things. So I went to Once Upon a Child to pick up some stuff and I'm just going to show you some of the things I got. So, and I showed some of these things actually in the other haul on my channel. So I'm just gonna really quickly go through them. They're all in a pile. So if you've seen them before, um, yeah, you know. So the first thing I got was this plain white tee and I did include this in the haul on my channel. Hope you can see it. Looks like that. Just a plain white t-shirt. Then I got this other plain white shirt for a baby girl. It looks like that. And the prices for these, $3.50 and $2.50. You can't beat that. And then I did get one more plain white tee because she definitely needed a bunch of those. So the next thing I'm excited for her to wear is this beautiful dress, guys. Oh, it's so cute. Um, it's got lots of little flowers and whatnot on it. So I really, well, not lots of flowers, just has two little flowers there. And I guess I was talking about the flower thing on the inside, but that's what it looks like. It's so cute and I need to get this in the, laundry ASAP because she's growing so fast. I feel like she's just growing out of everything. So I need to just get it on a roll. Um, in terms, oh, I did end up getting her another sweater. Maybe I went overboard with the whole white thing, but this is like a long sleeve. It's six months. All these clothing are in six months and I figure I will just buy it so she can have something long sleeve to wear it come summer. That's not too heavy and I think like it, I don't know depends on how big she grows she might be able to fit into this come fall so she's I think six months officially in June so we'll see how that goes um it's lightweight it's breathable you know um oh that dress came with undies by the way it came with came with these things so that's cute guess what I just found <laughs> I found another white shirt and like honestly I think I'm just more I'm more simple I gravitate towards the simple looks and I did choose to buy white because I figured she can wear it with a lot of stuff you know when you go with like pattern tops and whatnot you can't find stuff to match the bottoms and she had like a lot of leggings and things that were kind of florally or patterned and you just can't I don't know, the whole mixing and matching thing just got a little out of hand with that. So I just stuck to white. Got her these cute little shorts and, um, you know, turquoise, what is it, turquoise greenish with red, with pink hearts. The funny thing is the night before I was looking, Carter's had a sale and it was an online sale sell selling shorts like these, among other jean shorts, for like six bucks. And that was a super sweet deal because these things I think are usually like, 14 either 12 or 14 dollars on their own but um I ended up going to once upon a child I stopped by there briefly and I got these so well and I did I get another pair of shorts yeah I got one more pair of shorts which are so cute look at them oh all the things that are girly are so cute so cute oh man so one thing that I saw that I did get her was this um, top. Oh, can y'all see the real color? It looks like this. It says, be happy and always smile. $4.50 for that one. Um, yeah. And I don't know if she's going to fit it, but I think it's good to have a sweater come summer because sometimes it gets cool in the evening still. I did get her this gorgeous sun hat, and it's a Disney princess, y'all. Disney stuff are so expensive. When we went to Disney World, I remember picking up just those those ears for the girls and they were like 30 something dollars each so i do i am aware that disney stuff cost a pretty penny in fact this still has the original tag on it it was 60.95 so 
that's not bad i got it for 50 cents and it's brand new so shout out to disney or well it's actually really more like shout out to once upon a child so very very cute um i got her this bib which is also brand new it's really really cute just to you know one to wear to church i think more like over dresses and stuff to just catch anything got her this cute little one because i'm into like leopard and all prints cheetah prints you know all them prints so this is cute fit a cent you know 50 cents for that one and then i got this one i was showing before in the vlog on my channel i don't know it's a cute indoor bib so moving on i apologize if you saw this before but i did show some of those things in on my beauty channel but i have a lot more things to show you guys so um one of the <laughs> I wanted to show you guys these. Oh my gosh, check out these cute little shoes that I got her. They're brand new. They are so adorable. Oh my gosh, like shout out to like Once Upon a Child, honestly, because they make this baby shopping thing so easy. I can go there, I can find any everything, and this is not sponsored. Like I feel like they should sponsor me because I am, you know, I have been shouting them out quite a bit since I've had um, Baby Girl, but where else can you go and find baby shoes like like new for two dollars and fifty cents how cute are those look at them so um i've been getting a lot of stuff from my girlfriends for baby girl but she's just not there she's not at that stage to wear some of the things yet because they're still most of them are still like for her to as a toddler so i'm excited for her to wear those but for the meantime there are a few things that i had to pick up look at those oh, 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 oh. aren't they cute they were $2.50. $2.50. Cute little summer shoes. I hope her little feet can fit in it come summer. But you didn't try these on. So I'm going to try them on her feet like now because they've been sitting in the bag waiting for me. I also picked her up these cute little booties. Look at them. The kids haven't even seen any of these things. These are cute little high tops and they're colorful. They're from uh, what Children's Place and they're $2.50 as well. They're cute. They've got Velcro to just slip it on her feet. And they're just cute little high tops. She could probably even wear them when she start walking, I'm pretty sure, because they are not, I don't even remember what size they are, but they just look, oh, they said size one, but they're pretty big for size one. Another thing that I did get, guys, are these cute little um, Robies and these honestly they have a lot of sentimental value because when the girls were young these are the exact Robies that they all wore I bought it from Michaela and then all three of the girls ended up wearing them and I got rid of them because I thought I was done having kids so I parted with stuff and I found them again so I had to get them yeah that's just gonna bring back so much sentimental value <laughs> when she when I see her baby girl in them and when she's standing up and you know walking these were actually 650 they're a little bit pricier than the other stuff but honestly back in the days when we bought robies they were a lot of money they were not cheap and this is a fraction of the price that's cool one other thing that i got while i was there this is actually new but it was a tropical headband it looks like this and i thought zoe's gonna look so cute in it mind you i do have like a headband addiction because she has quite a few and she hasn't exactly worn a ton of them yet she wore some for her christening and then she wore some for I don't know for she, she's cute in the background hope y'all aren't too distracted but yeah good good stuff so another thing that I bought for her were these cute little skirt this is from Jamboree so adorable and they're brand new and they are four bucks this is from a different um consignment shop not once upon a child so this one's a little bit more pricey i find i got her this cute little dress and this one was six bucks six bucks and the back is like this with a little cutout isn't that cute and i love like the little crinkled effect of the dress so cute and i'm trying to rush because i literally have supper on the stove for you you know guys um then I got her these cute little roots pants. I love it because the bum part is like cut out like that. It's so adorable. Super cute and soft. Um, the, this color is a little different because it's like purple. I know it wasn't darker, but it's almost like a wash. kind of gives it like a washed out look. I debated about this one, but honestly, it was two bucks. Definitely worth it. It's super soft and she'll have it for a, a while. So, Zoe, you're making a ton of noise in the background. Like a ton of noise. 
And last but not least, for just for baby, um, last but not least for baby, I bought her Zoe. Do you hear her, this kid? Oh my gosh, I hope you guys can hear me through her. I'm sorry, or hear me over her. But because you guys know we're big readers, we love to read, we've got a ton of books, and we've got a ton of libraries, but it's still hard. Like, I, you know, because we have a ton of books, I sometimes not want to get books. I don't want to buy any, but at the same time, I want to... Zoe, Zoe. Why is she so loud? I sometimes want to still contribute to the library because I feel like it's important for her to get some books of her own, so... Got her this one, Book of Nursery Rhymes. And clearly she likes it because she's happy in the background. Got her this one, Blue Hat, Green Hat by um, Sandra Boyton, I believe. And we have all the books. Why? Why? We have a lot of her books already, so I thought that was a good one to add. Then I got this one, Dinosaur Dance which is a great book, a great book for babies as well. And um, just has, book of, I don't know, talks about dinosaurs and whatnot. I read it before I bought it. And last but not least is Click Clack Moo, Cows That Type. Never seen this book, thought it was kind of funny and it was 50 cents. So, no, actually it was a dollar. I can see the price on the back. Well, that is it for the haul for Zoe. I think I'm actually going to break it up because you heard the noise and it's already 12 minutes. So if you guys comment down below and like it and sh and uh, get this video, I don't know to how many likes. I don't know how many of you guys really love all these hauls that I post. But if you guys really, really like it, I will post the other one. Um on this channel which i think i still might um the other one will be a haul of me and the kids and i and hopefully zoe will be asleep or something so the video can be nice and smooth and not noisy so anyways thank you guys for watching and hope you guys enjoyed the video comment down below and let me know what's your favorite piece that i bought her and maybe give me some suggestions of things that i could buy her i think some of the items that i need are like rompers she definitely needs more shorts um, what's your go-to item? What's your favorite go-to items for babies in the summer? Because I like things that are easy and functional and just like, you know, we can just get out the house. So thanks for watching, guys, and much love. Bye.